home. I thought we had pizza, but then I remembered we ate it for breakfast. Can you bring home chips? I have a situation here. Get your own chips. Wait, have you not left yet? Are you still there? No. Well, yes, but I am making my escape as we speak. Did you fall asleep? <gasps> Were you snuggling? Were you the big spoon or the little spoon? Did he whisper sweet nothings right up your- Rippy, shut up. Well, this sounds dignified. You never fall asleep. Never mind with a stranger. I never took you for a double dipper, Lola. You're on the talk. Double dip more times than a kebab and garlic sauce. So if it's someone that you've seen before, then it's clearly someone that you've seen recently because your ghost game is strong. Ah, oh, Doc Casper only knows. Well, it wouldn't be one of your last three because of that, you know, weird coincidence. Right. How was I supposed to know they were brothers? It's not like I asked for their last name or anything. How did you get to his? <sighs> Car. Well, you're not stupid enough to go anywhere with a drunk driver, but that club is so disgusting that you cannot be sober in it, which means you called someone to pick you up, backing up my theory that it is someone you already know. All right, Shagatha Christie. What's more? You got back, done the deed, and fell asleep all within a two hour window, which means that it's someday local, but if it was out our end of the city, then you would have offered a lift to me and, what's his face? Which means that your sexual encounter is someone who you're trying to hide from me. So I deduce, Lola, that you have either slept with one, an ex of mine. Unlikely, because you know I don't care. Mm -hmm. Two, my father. Oh. I sincerely hope not, but I'm not ruling anything out. Or three, your thick Canadian driving instructor. The one that uses that manky wee Corsa as dog in central for all his students. You tacky bitch. Where's my chips? How, how did you... Bloody hell, you really got that in the bag, I thought Shagatha Christie. <laughs> well, I am the smart one. I need danger, you're a regular brain. How'd you actually know? I tracked your phone, ya fanny. Of course. <laughs> Turn on the track before you lie on your back. Turn on the tracker before he touches your clacker. Let the girls know before going down below, because let's face it, any one of us could go missing. And I would want that bloody bastard fanged. And even if he was, they'd still somehow find a way to blame us. Aye, too true. There's a chip shop around the corner from you. But you know, you could stay if you wanted to. Aye, I could stay. I mean, I did leave my bra in his car. And I might actually want to. <sighs> Definitely not. Nope, nope, I'll be home soon. Don't 